Luckiest Girl Alive trailer, Mila Kunis is a survivor with a secret in Netflix thriller. What happens when Lady Luck is down, out, and in need of a reinvention after a traumatic attack? Mila Kunis stars as the titular Luckiest Girl Alive in the Netflix adaptation of Jessica Knowles' best-selling 2015 novel of the same name. The film premieres in select theaters September 30th and will stream on Netflix October 7th. Kunis plays New York Times Magazine editor Ani Fonelli, who seems to be living the perfect New York City life, with the best fashion, best friends, and best fiancé, Finn Wittrock. Ani has it all, until the director of a true crime documentary approaches her to relive a shocking incident from her prestigious high school. Ani is forced to confront a past that threatens her future. I don't know what's me, and what part I invented, Kunis as Ani says in the trailer. Cruel summer breakout Kiara Aurelia plays the teen version of Ani, with Thomas Barbuska, Scoot McNary, Justine Lupe, Dalmar Abuzade, Alex Barone, Carson McCormack, and Jennifer Beals also starring. Connie Britton portrays Annie's mother. I don't know what's me, and what part I invented. Director Mike Barker helms the film and also executive produces alongside screenwriter Noel, Lisa Sturbikoff, Shane Fisk Goldner, and Steve Hutensky. Lead star Kunis produces the film as well as Bruna Papandrea, Jean Snow, Eric Fag, and Lucy Kadida. Novelist, screenwriter, and executive producer Noel shared that she could not be present on set during the climatic sequence due to her personal experience with traumatic events. Former Cosmopolitan editor Noel revealed in 2016 that she was gang raped as a teenager. Noel penned a personal essay for Lena Dunham's Lenny Letter saying that Luckiest Girl Alive helped her confront her trauma. The first person to tell me I was gang raped was a therapist, seven years after the fact, Noel wrote, via People. The second was my literary agent, five years later, only she wasn't talking about me. She was talking about Ani, the protagonist of my novel, Luckiest Girl Alive, which is a work of fiction. What I've kept to myself, up until today, is that its inspiration is not. Noel continued, I've been running and I've been ducking and I've been dodging because I'm scared. I'm scared people won't call what happened to me rape because for a long time, no one did. 